Sorry, Courtney here. Um, and today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. So I figured that I could do a, um, a new YouTuber task. So if you've been watching my videos and you're subscribed to my channel, then you're going to see, um, you know, a lot of different things about me, but I probably haven't answered like, you know, the personal things about me like i haven't said really much about myself personally to tell y'all so i figured that we could do kind of like a coffee talk i could sit here drink my coffee before i've got to go to work and answer some primary questions so maybe y'all can learn a little bit about me um and it'll help us feel more um, like friends instead of just somebody that you're watching for videos <laughs> Um, so first question is, what is my name? So my name is Courtney Cox. Yes, like the actress. Um, so you're hearing my dog in the back. I'm sorry about that. He is a barker. <laughs> um, he must be a cat. Anyways, Courtney Cox. Uh, my mom says, Alice, Alice, stop. Stop. My mom said that when she named me Courtney, um, Courtney Cox actually wasn't famous at all at the time. So she said that I think shortly after she named me Courtney Cox, that that's when Courtney Cox actually got like brought onto the stage by I think the Rolling Stones. And so then that's when Courtney Cox really took off and she became famous. So at least that's what my mom says. So, cause she was like, I didn't really, <laughs> she was like, I wouldn't have just named you after Courtney Cox or Cat sent to her, but you know, it was, my mom wasn't like a huge fan or something. <laughs> okay, so second question, um, where are you from? What are you doing? I come from a really small town in Texas called Normandy, Texas. Um, I think my graduating class was, I don't even know, like 30 or 40 people. I pretty much went to school with the same people my entire life, like knew the same people from kindergarten to senior, same people. So yeah, really, really small school, really small town. Um, it is Central Texas and it is close to College Station where Texas A&M is. So if that gives you any kind of idea there. Okay, how tall are you? I am five foot six. Um, oh no, Atlas. Oh no, you're knocking my camera down. I'm five foot six. So I actually checked my height the other day. Um, I think it was like in a Home Depot when I was with my boyfriend, and it said that I was five foot seven. Not sure if it was the shoes I was wearing. I don't really remember or if I grew from the last time I checked myself. I honestly, if we're being honest, I haven't checked myself hike-wise since like my eighth grade like home ec class when I was five foot six. So I might have grown. How siblings do you have? I have zero siblings, zero. I have an only child. Um, and before you think like, oh, she's an only child, she's spoiled. I am not. I was not raised a spoiled child. My parents, um, especially my dad, raised me to be very, very hardworking. Um, I worked for what I had. I appreciated what I had. Super grateful for it because now it has led into my adult life. And I will raise my children the same way. Zero siblings, just me. <laughs> the next question, is this your first channel? This is my first channel. Um, when I first started out, probably I think it's been like five months ago, I had no idea what I was doing, no idea with editing. I just know that I really enjoyed making YouTube videos. So like I went for it. The more I did it, the more I enjoyed it. <laughs> kind of had a little stall in between to where I was just like, you know, I'm not really getting as many views as I'd like. I'm not getting as much progress as I'd like, etc., etc. So I really had to take a step back and assess why I was doing it and if I was enjoying it like for something for me or just because I wanted the views. So once I did reassess and I thought about what I actually enjoyed, I really enjoyed YouTube videos. So I was just like, you know, I'm going to do it because I enjoy doing it. <laughs> Question six, <laughs> what is your channel about? So my channel, I would like to say is a um, lifestyle wellness vlogging channel. 
So um, my goal as a YouTuber is to motivate and inspire, um, create happiness for others, and yeah, just entertain, I guess you would say. Um, I really want to spread the news about um, creating a life that you enjoy and that you love and creating happiness. I hope that I can do that through my vlogs, through my videos, um, and that I can help to motivate and inspire you. I, I'm all about good vibes. Um, I want to start eventually talking about the law of, you can't have my coffee, you can't have my coffee. I want to eventually start talking about like, what you about the law of attraction, uh, manifesting life, um, the life that you want, how the universe is working for you, um, and showing y'all, <laughs> showing y'all, uh, you are just making it difficult, showing y'all wellness and stuff like that, oh my gosh, then why should anyone subscribe to your channel? Because you just should, no, I'm just kidding, <laughs> you should subscribe to my channel for sure, because one, I would love to be friends. Um, we don't have to be friends, obviously, in real life, but I would love to create a friendship through this awesome um, social media outlet. Um, also, you should subscribe to my channel because, like I said, I hope with my videos to always inspire and motivate, and I hope to always um, send out really positive vibes and um, create joy and happiness and show you how, like, your life can be full of joy and happiness as well. Where do you see yourself and your YouTube channel in five years? So, my dog needs to <laughs> Yeah, all kinds of problems. Okay. So where do you see yourself and your YouTube channel in five years? Um, so I see myself and my YouTube channel. I see myself in five years probably with a another Boston Terrier. I really want to breed my Boston and get him, um, have one of his puppies. And I see myself married to Ian um, as having, if not two, then one child. Um, having a ho home of our own, a house that we actually own. And my YouTube channel, I really hope in five years I can have, I not I really hope, I'm going to manifest that I'm going to have 400,000 subscribers in five years. That might be too low. I don't know, but that's a good start, I feel like, in five years, you know. So, yeah, that's where I see myself in five years. <laughs> Okay, number nine, what inspired you to start making videos? I am so glad this came up. So, I was inspired to start making YouTube videos um, by another YouTuber that I saw and I found through Pinterest. Um, she was showing through her videos how to get out of debt, how to budget, um, how much money they were making from YouTube. Um, stuff like that, and she inspired me to start making YouTube videos, honestly. Um, it's really, really kind of sad because recently, I'm not going to say who it was or anything like that, but recently, I guess I accidentally, not accidentally, I was doing something that I guess was considered spam, and I totally didn't mean for it to come off that way, but, and I wrote her a really long message on Instagram how, like, she inspired me to start, I hope there wasn't any bad feelings, anything like that. Like, I'm so, so genuinely sorry. And she blocked me on Instagram. Yeah, so that was really hurtful for me. Um, like I said, I'm a really positive person, and I'm also the kind of person I want everybody to like me. I know that not everybody's going to like me. I get that. But she was, like, my inspiration to start YouTube to begin with. So for the fact that I went out of my way to you know, apologize and tell her that she was my inspiration and to block me on Instagram was really hurtful because I can guarantee you, um, unless you're like weird and stalkerish or something, I will not block you, especially if you come to me, apologize for what you did and, you know, tell me that I was your inspiration to start YouTube and that I motivated you. Oh my gosh, I'd be like, girl, thank you. Like, let's be best friends. I would never, ever block you. So yeah, that was really hurtful. That was hard. But she's who inspired me to start making YouTube videos. So 
It is what it is. <laughs> Who are some of your favorite YouTubers? Um, so some of my favorite YouTubers are definitely, I really like Lavender. Um, I like Sarah's Day. Um, I just followed a new channel and I love her channel. And I can't think of what it's called. I follow so many YouTubers right now. Um, I really like Nikki. Um, yeah, I really like people that also post vlogs and post things that I'm into, like um, living a healthy lifestyle, um, wellness, manifestation. Um, ooh, Renee Amberg, Amberg, I hope I'm saying that. She's probably one of my favorites. I love her videos. I get a ton of inspiration from her videos. So yeah, I would say those are some of my favorite YouTubers that I definitely look up to at the moment. <laughs> Number 11, what does your username mean? My username is my name and blog. <laughs> Courtney Cox blog. It's pretty self-explanatory. I really have been meaning to change it. I'm trying to come up with something catchy, so if you have any ideas, let me know in the comments. I really want something like, like, I don't even know what I could say, like, Courtney Cox creating happiness or like Courtney Cox cultivating happy like something catchy and ringy but I just haven't came up with the perfect thing and then I was like well maybe I'll change it to Courtney Cox blog but like you only get so many chances to change your name so like in a certain period of time so I've been really kind of like mm, I don't want to change it just yet you know I have like serious decision making issues <laughs> Okay. Excuse me. Best thing about YouTube. Hmm. I would say the best thing about YouTube is so many people get to express themselves and share it with others. Um, it's a really, really good outlet, a creative, creative outlet to share and express um, your feelings, your joy, your happiness your ideas, your DIY, um, you know, so many different things. And it's awesome how it gets so many different places in the world. So it, you know, to India and, you know, England and Australia, and it gets so many different places and we're all just connected through YouTube. I find that so awesome. I really like that about YouTube, for sure. Um, worst thing about YouTube, when you're inspired by somebody and then they block you on Instagram. <laughs> That's probably been my worst thing about YouTube, just because it hurt my feelings. Um, so, because it makes you think for, stop and think for a second, hmm, maybe she's not as nice in her videos as she comes off. Maybe she's acting this entire time and then like only for her videos and she's really not as cool as she seems. So that kind of gave me a bad taste in my mouth because I was like, well, there is really no telling what she's like in real life. There's no telling what anybody's like in real life, just like Instagram, you know, you're putting on a show. But I hope to always be very authentic and not just putting on a show. I want to create happiness for y'all to see, create motivation, but I also want to be very authentic with y'all at all times. Um, because I just want to be myself and I feel like that's how everybody should be. What are your goals? Number 14. <laughs> I keep forgetting to say the number. Uh, what are your goals when it comes to YouTube? So my goals when it comes to YouTube is I want my YouTube to grow enough to where I can create a business from YouTube. So, and the reason of this is I think I have now I think, I know I have the potential to create happiness and coach others to be happy, joyful, um, motivational in others. Um, and I've always thought, what do I want to do with my life? And when I'm helping others and when I'm creating happiness in others is when I'm happiest. Um, it makes me feel fulfilled. So I would like to grow a big enough following to where I can inspire and motivate others. Um, because that's just what I want to do. And from that, I want to create either like a coaching system or, 
you know, a program or, you know, hey, email me or call me if you have any questions or need something. Um, I want to do something to help people. And so I'm hoping through YouTube, I can reach those people through following, through subscribers, through building my subscriber list. <laughs> Clean number 15, any advice for new YouTubers? I see a lot of girls in comments um, when I'm reading like popular YouTubers say that they're not confident um, in starting their YouTube. And I say just do it. Just be yourself. You know, don't think about being anybody else or being like this YouTuber or that YouTuber or oh, this person like looks like this. Or, yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Or like, oh, I need to. <laughs> he's a... I love him, but he's a stinker. Wait, don't feel the need or the pressure to be like other people. Be you. Be who you are, and people are gonna love it. Um, people are going to see who you are, and you know, we don't want a bunch of people that are exactly the same. The world would be so boring if that was the case. So take what the universe has given you in yourself and show it to the world because you are special and unique and there's only one of you and you're like that for a reason. So let the world know it, you know, don't be afraid to show it. <laughs> that wasn't supposed to rhyme, but it did. And then I was just like, that was, that was cheesy. Instantly regretted that. <laughs> yeah, wasn't it? Bless you, you got the allergies. Wasn't sure how I felt about that. <laughs> so yeah, guys, um, a couple more things about me before I get off that aren't on these questions. I'm 28, um, I live with my boyfriend, Ian. We have one puppy, Atlas, who is five. Yeah, and he's our little pride and joy. We love to do outdoor things, so um, kayaking. Oh. Kayaking, hiking, um, anything outdoors. Um, when we're not outdoors, we're probably going to different towns, visiting new towns, um, stuff like that. Uh, my favorite store is TJ Maxx or Marshall's Bar Bar, um, and his favorite store is like Home Depot or Lowe's, <laughs> which I've gotten to where I like Lowe's just as much as him. <laughs> For the sake of the rest of this video, we're going to film it right here because my dog just keeps jumping and it's going everywhere, so, and it's just a mess. Don't have any kids, no kiddos right now. Um, my favorite, why can't I think of the word? My favorite season is fall. Uh, my favorite holiday is for sure Halloween. My job is a waitress. I'm actually a waitress and I love it. Don't hate. It makes really good money. You'd be really surprised. <laughs> All right, guys. So thank you so much for watching this video. Um, if you have any other questions you'd like to ask me, just let me know in the comments and I would love to answer them. Um, yeah, and make sure you subscribe to my channel. I hope you enjoyed this video so much. Um, and remember, as always, send out positive vibes to others, guys. You never know who might be needing it in their day and whose day it might make. Um, have a great day, guys.